Have you ever struggled to see if the black mark on your target was a bullet hole or just a shadow? Next time at the range, don't just bring your binoculars. Bring a high quality spotting scope such as this Nikon ED field scope. It will easily let you determine if it's a shadow or a bullet hole. A lot of people think spotting scopes are just extra weight to carry and not worth the trouble. Don't let that common misconception cost you some great viewing opportunities. Spotting scopes are generally bigger and heavier than your binocular, but they do have their place. When ultra high magnification is needed, a spotting scope is what you should turn to. Plus they can save you miles and time no matter if you're spotting on foot or from a vehicle. Tip number one. Transporting your spotting scope can be the biggest hassle of all, but Nikon's new Field Recon Optics Pack solves that problem. The Optics Pack lets you carry your spotting scope, binocular, and rangefinder in one specially designed pack. Each component is protected and easy to access. You can even transport your tripod on the side of the pack, plus there are plenty of pockets for the rest of your gear. Tip number two. Comfort is the key to getting the most out of your Nikon field scope or spotter. Try to set up in a manner that allows you to glass without a lot of bending or twisting on your part. Some people find it easier to look through a scope for long periods of time if they use an eye patch on the opposite eye. A cushion to sit on can make a big difference as well. Sometimes an angled scope is easier to use, especially if you are forced to use a short tripod. Tip number three. Finding game with a spotting scope is a little different than using your binocular. The best scenario is to use your binocular to locate animals and then closely check them out with the spotter. If you're glassing with the scope, use it on a lower power setting if possible and then crank it up when you find your trophy. Tip number four. If you're a backpack hunter who worries about saving ounces, check out the Nikon ED50. It's a super lightweight spotting scope with Nikon's ultra-sharp ED glass. With an eyepiece, the ED50 barely tips the scales at 19 ounces, a sheep hunter's dream. To help you get the most out of your field scope or other Nikon spotter, here are some basic maintenance tips. Never wipe the lens with your shirt, as tempting as that is, it can damage the lens coatings. If you notice some dust or dirt on the lens, try and remove it with your breath or a puff bottle. If you do have to touch the lens, do so carefully and only enough to remove the debris. Lubricating the lens with a lens cleaning solution helps clean as well. Purchase and keep a high quality lens cleaning kit like those offered by Nikon. It has everything in it you will likely need to maintain your lens. When you're not using your scope, Keep it in the protective soft case to cut down on dust and dirt. Tip number six. A quality spotting scope such as Nikon's Field Scope or Pro Staff Spotter are completely waterproof and fogproof on the interior. However, cold, damp weather can sometimes cause condensation on the exterior of the lenses. An effective remedy for this is to use Nikon's Fog Eliminator Anti-Fog Cloth on the lenses of your optics prior to leaving for a hunt. The reusable cloth utilizes a dry compound that stops condensation from forming on lens surfaces including eyeglasses. Tip number seven. Enjoy your field scope all season long by trying digiscoping. Nikon pioneered this fun hobby and it uses a lot of equipment you already have. Simply put, digiscoping is using your spotting scope as a camera lens. Nikon makes adapters for almost any of their cool picks or other Nikon cameras. You simply need to replace your current eyepiece with a digiscoping one and purchase a camera bracket to secure your camera to the back of the scope. Then by using a remote or cable shutter release, start taking some amazing photos. Wildlife never looks so good. And the first time downrange, don't forget to bring plenty of targets.